What's good guys, my name is Sector Marchena and today I'm going to show you guys my four favorite exercises for chest. But before we do that, like I said, I'm going to take half a scoop and I like to take it just straight up just to get, just to get right to it. I love how it gives me the energy for my gym, the focus, and then I'm just ready to kill it. Alright, so we're going to get started with the pig deck flying machine. Just to get loosened up, get the blood flow going. I'm only gonna do four sets, about 15 to 12 reps, depending how I'm feeling. Here we go, first set, 12 reps. Get that blood flow going, get a nice stretch before the real workout. Stretch, and you wanna squeeze. Stretch, squeeze. Next exercise is going to be the incline bench press. I like to start kind of light, four sets, and then I start with 12 reps, 10 reps, and my last two reps is going to be 8-8, eight, eight. but the weights keep going up. Retract the scapula, stay injury free. Here we go. Nice stretch. Alright, so you want to start with the weight where you feel comfortable, okay? Now, right now, my last set, two plates, you always want a progressive overload. What do I mean by that? You always want to get better, either with weight or reps. Either you're doing more reps or you're doing more weight. Eventually, you progress little by little and that's how you build muscle. Getting stronger and getting better. Alright guys, so throughout my workout I like to sip on my VCAs. My favorite flavor is the guava flavor and the watermelon. Now, the reason why I like to sip on my, on my VCAs during my workout is to stay hydrated and it actually helps you with your joints too. Next exercise is going to be the flat bench with dumbbells. If you have any imbalances, doing dumbbells is going to help you a lot. Because when you're on the barbell, you got to with both hands. So this hand might help you a little more, but when we're we doing it with dumbbells, there's no way you're using the same weight with the same arms, with different arms. So here we go, four sets. Again, let's start with 12 reps. Alright guys, last exercise, weighted dips. So we started with the peg that fly machine to get a nice blood flow going, nice stretch. Then we move up to the incline for the upper chest, we move it to the flat for the side chest, and now we want to hit the lower chest. So what you're gonna do here is get a full stretch all the way down, all the way up. Full stretch, boom. And there you guys have it. Again, sometimes I get a lot of questions, how to lose fat on, under your chest or whatever. Remember, nutrition is the key to everything. Then killing it as you work as every single day, 
and like I said at the beginning, supplementation is the icing on the cake. Hi guys, to finish off, we're gonna do some ladder drills. If you if you're if you're bored of the basic stairmaster cardio, treadmill cardio, get out there and enjoy your cardio. Flip a tire, do some drills like I'm doing here. So what I'm doing, just quick steps and then take a sprint. I'm doing that about 12 times and we're out of here. So what got me into fitness was I was really skinny back in high school. I weighed at around 110 pounds. Actually, I have a picture here that I can show you guys. I was really, really small. My confidence level was at its lowest. And I actually joined a football team and that's how I started working out. But back then I didn't know anything. You'll see me in the bench press every single day, just doing chest every day which I have no clue about nutrition, you know? So another reason why I got into fitness is because uh, the gym was a way of me to let my mind free and let my stress out. You know, I used, um, I was born in McAllen, Texas, but I was raised in Mexico. My life in Mexico was a little harsh, but now that I decided, I decided to move here to the United States to have a better future, better life, uh, the gym was my escape to all of that. My thing was to gain weight. So one of my biggest challenges was eating. So as I started getting more involved into fitness, I've noticed that nutrition was the number one key to everything. You wanna gain weight, your nutrition has to be on point. You wanna lose fat, your nutrition has to be on point. Now, supplementation is the icing on the cake. My favorite, my favorite supplement that I take every single day is the protein. Why? Because sometimes it's hard for me to hit my protein goal. And when I'm in a hurry, when I'm uh, as soon as I finish my workout or whatever, that I don't have time to really eat, I'm quick and simple. Make my protein shake. The peanut butter chocolate blast is my favorite, like I said, and it's it's just way easier for me to hit my protein goal throughout the day. Yes.